wrap your feet in cabbage leaves, and say goodbye to joint pain. You could say that joint pain and humankind go way back. As a matter of fact, scientists know that Utsi the Iceman, Europe's oldest known natural human mummy, who supposedly lived between 3400 and 3100 BCE, suffered from arthritic pain. You see, we're like old buddies. Only the one of us makes the other's life a living nightmare. Painful, swollen joints can make it hard to sit, walk, sleep, or get anything done. Sure, you can try painkillers, gels, or sprays, but half of the time they don't work or the effect is short-lived. So why not try cabbage leaves? <laughs> no joke! Our arthritic ancestors have been using it for centuries. In fact, they had lots of natural remedies to relieve the pain of stiff, swollen joints. If you're ready to find out 12 time-tested remedies to get rid of joint pain, then keep on watching! Number 1. Cabbage Leaves No, you're not going to eat them, but instead wrap them around the affected joint. Cabbage contains apigenin, a flavonoid compound with anti-inflammatory properties. The effectiveness of this centuries-old remedy was tested in a 2016 study involving 81 patients with osteoarthritis. Some were instructed to use cabbage leaf wraps, while others were asked to use their usual methods of treatment. In the end, the group that used cabbage leaves saw a significant reduction in arthritic pain compared to the others. How to use it Remove the hard stem and press the leaf to release some of its juices. Wrap the cabbage leaf in foil and place it in the oven for a few minutes to warm it up. Make sure it doesn't get too hot or burnt. Then, simply wrap the leaf around the painful joint to completely encase it. Hold the leaf in place by wrapping the covered joint with a bandage. Finally, cover everything in plastic wrap or aluminum foil to keep the warmth in. Wear this wrap for at least one hour. Or leave it on overnight to wake up with pain-free joints. Now that's definitely a much better way to start your day, don't you think? Number 2. Google Google is a sticky gum-like resin from the Mukul tree. It's good for joint pain because it naturally neutralizes the primary gene responsible for determining inflammatory reactions in the body. Researchers at Southern University of Health Sciences found that arthritis patients who use Google for one month experienced reduced pain, swelling, and stiffness. How to use it Add a quarter teaspoon of Google tincture you can get it in most health food stores, to one half a teaspoon of water. Drink it 30 minutes before each meal, three times a day. Number 3. Eucalyptus Oil Eucalyptus oil has both anti-inflammatory and analgesic or painkilling properties. It also relieves pain associated with conditions like rheumatoid arthritis, osteoarthritis, and even muscle injuries. A 2013 study conducted in South Korea found that using eucalyptus oil as an aromatherapy, that is, by inhaling it, was very effective in decreasing pain. However, you can also apply it topically for faster results. How to use it Mix 8 to 10 drops of eucalyptus oil with the same amount of peppermint oil. Then, add 3 to 5 teaspoons of any carrier oil like olive oil or moringa oil. Rub this onto your aching joints and feel instant cooling pain relief. Number 4. Black Cohosh Black Cohosh acts as an antispasmodic for nerves and muscles. It contains salicylic acid, which has anti-inflammatory properties and is a major ingredient in aspirin. Since ancient times, this plant has been used to treat an assortment of muscular, pelvic, and rheumatic pains. How to use it The recommended dose of black cohosh ranges from 40 to 80 milligrams a day. If you purchase the tincture, add about 2 to 4 milliliters to a glass of water or a cup of tea three times a day. You can also find it in capsules. People with liver problems, especially women, should avoid this herb. Number 5. 
Cinnamon Cinnamon contains a compound called cinnamaldehyde, which stops the release of arachidonic acid, an inflammatory fatty acid. This makes cinnamon effective at reducing inflammation caused by joint diseases like arthritis. How to use it Mix 2 teaspoons of honey and 1 teaspoon of cinnamon powder in a cup of hot water. Drink it once in the morning and once at night. Number 6. Alfalfa The alfalfa plant is one of the best herbal remedies on the market for both back and joint pain resulting from inflammatory arthritis. This herb contains loads of vitamins, minerals, and other nutrients that play a crucial role in not only bone health, but overall wellness as well. The best way to have it is herbal tea. How to use it Your brew will use equal parts alfalfa leaves, red raspberry leaves, and peppermint. Add one tablespoon of the tea mixture to a cup of boiling water. Let it brew for about five minutes, wait for it to cool down, and then drink up. Number 7. Turmeric In Chinese and Indian Ayurvedic medicine, turmeric powder has traditionally been used to treat arthritis and joint pain. And that's because turmeric blocks inflammatory cytokines and enzymes. In a 2016 study carried out by researchers from South Korea and the US, turmeric was found to reduce joint pain and swelling in patients. How to use it Mix one spoonful of turmeric powder to a cup of warm milk. Drink this milk in the evening before going to sleep in order to get a good night's rest. Also, make sure that you consume turmeric regularly to reduce joint pain and inflammation caused by arthritis. You can simply sprinkle the powder over your food. Number 8. Cloves this ancient herb originating from Indonesia has been used for generations in Chinese and Indian medicine to alleviate joint pain. Research has shown that adding cloves to your diet can reduce inflammation caused by arthritis by about 44%. It also keeps new inflammatory cytokines from popping up in your joints. How to use it You can add it to your food or even brew tea with it. If you don't like its taste, you can take clove supplements in pill form. Number 9. Devil's Claw Don't get spooked by the name. It's just called this because of the spiky claw-like hooks that cover the fruit. Devil's Claw is a plant that grows in the deserts of southern Africa. For centuries, natives of the Kalahari Desert have used the dry roots of this plant to treat joint pain. How to use it As a tea, brew 5 grams of the dried root daily for relief of joint or muscle pain. If you can't find dried roots, you can always go for supplementary capsules or look for products that contain devil's claw extract. Number 10. Willow Bark Willow bark is one of the oldest traditional methods used to treat inflammation. In fact, even during the time of Hippocrates in the 5th century BCE, people would chew on willow bark to help treat inflammatory conditions. Willow's bark effectiveness at relieving arthritic joint pain is thanks to the fact that it contains a chemical compound called salicin, which is similar to aspirin. How to use it Although some people prefer to just chew on the bark of a willow tree, you can find willow bark capsules in a lot of pharmacies and almost any health food store. The recommended dose is about 240 milligrams a day. Also, some stores sell willow bark tea, which you can just brew for two to three minutes in hot water. Number 11. Acupressure. The traditional Chinese practice of acupressure has been around since 600 BCE and is known to do wonders for your overall health and wellness. Press on the following joints specifically for joint relief. LI4. To find this point, simply bring your index finger and thumb together. Where the little mound forms between them is the spot you need. 
Use deep, firm pressure to massage and stimulate this area for about 5 seconds. LV2 This point is located on the webby fold between the big toe and the second toe. Apply medium pressure using your index fingers, pressing on both feet at the same time. You can also press one foot at a time if it's more comfortable for you. GB41 This one is located on the top of the foot, in the channel between the little toe and the fourth toe. Press it with your index finger using firm pressure. Number 12. Moxibustion And here's yet another traditional Chinese practice, but you'll need to see a professional if you want to try this one out. Moxibustion is a form of heat therapy in which dried mugwort is burnt on particular points of the body. It's widely used in other East Asian countries to manage the symptoms of rheumatoid arthritis, and practitioners swear by it. Actually, research published in the Jilin Journal of Traditional Chinese Medicine found that moxibustion combined with acupuncture had an 83.3% effectiveness in alleviating chronic joint pain. Do you know any other century-old remedies for joint pain? Tell us in the comments below! If you found this video helpful, give it a like and share it with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe 